चाणक्य से सुख से मूलम धर्म धर्म से मूलम अर्थ अर्थ से मूलम राज्यम माने सुख का जो मूल है वो धर्म है धर्म का जो मूल है वो अर्थ है माने संपदा यानी संपत्ति और अर्थ से मूलम राज्य राज्य जो है वो उसका मूल है एंड ही गोज ऑन एडिंग दैट अर्थ संपदाम प्रकृति संपदाम करोती इफ यू आर रिच देन यू कैन हेल्प द प्रिजर्वेशन एंड कंजर्वेशन ऑफ द नेचर एंड देन ही एड्स दैट प्रकृति संपदाम ह्या न कमी राज्यम गरीयते एंड प्रकृति कोप सर्व कोपे भ्यो गरीयसी वाट दिस दू सेंटेंस मीन्स इज इफ अ नेशन और ए स्टेट इज सुपर रिच इन बायोडाइवर्सिटी the nature conservation then if there is no head of the state or the nation still that nation and the state will survive if not then prakriti kopa sarv kope bhyo gariyashi the fury of nature tops the list matlab prakriti ka gussa sare gussa se bada hota hai mane durghatna ho jayegi ye ecological disturbance ki jo hum baat kar rahe hain aajkal That has already been written by Chanakya. If you go a little behind, what does Veda say? Veda says that ten wells are equal to one pond. Ten ponds are equal to one spring. Ten spring is equal to one sun, that child, beta, and ten suns are equal to one tree. That had been the practice and the reverence given to the biodiversity. That a tree. टॉप्स द लिस्ट यदि बेटे से भी बढ़ के है पेड़ दस बेटों के बराबर एक पेड़ होता है एंड इट गोज डाउन टू द वाटर कंजर्वेशन एंड ऑल दैट वाई वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस टूडे ऑन दिस डे ऑफ नेचर कंजर्व वर्ल्ड नेचर कंजर्वेशन डे द नेचर इज सफरिंग प्रकृति छटपटा रही है ऑल दिस इकोलॉजिकल डिस्टर्बेंस इज दैट सडन रेन और नो रेन इधर इट्स टू मच और इट्स टू लेस in terms of temperature in terms of water i mean the rain everything is because the nature has lost its balance and only and only because of the human effort manav prayas ki wajah se aisa hua and if you look around here you know show them on this stone all these native stones small and big they are still there but the greenery has come when we conserve the nature in the true sense in a practical sense what comes out is the turmeric laden with 17 different medicinal properties all these plants marigold and so many other things we need to learn this art of preservation of nature and that is why this campus of art of living international and this model farm of permaculture started teaching and sharing this conservation knowledge through permaculture the permanent agriculture and in that chain of different courses and seminars that we have done more than 100 we have come with a permaculture retreat a 9 day residential program where you learn the typical preservation and the dimensions of this preservation goes on like earth air water cows you know the the uh, trees and plants then how to handle the disease everything else and once the fertility of the earth purity of the water and freshness of air has gone to its peak no matter where you are in this country or in the world you will be able to grow that was being grown for millenniums in your place that's the trick we put all our blood and sweat in what to grow and you know how to fight the disease and health of that plant and the crop i tell you for my to my understanding that's a wrong notion you concentrate more on on earth increase the fertility naturally preserve it if you cannot increase the fertility at least preserve it preservation also goes a long way increasing the fertility a farmer will do but conserving the fertility all of us can do and that is why these kind of efforts which comes from a saint a blessing of the saint you know gurudev said start sharing this and we are here with this retreat see if you can join thank you so much jai gurudev